All right, this video is to show you guys how to do some very simple special effects um, for your video making. So the first thing is you're gonna wanna get um, some example special effects clips. So on the Gators blog um, under filmmaking, I've put a couple of links for you um, to check out on YouTube. So for example, this one here is a playlist of 15 uh, smoke green screen effects. Over here is about 160 plus effects that you can look through. There's some pretty cool ones there. Um, I have not gone through all of these clips, so if there's anything there that is inappropriate, then we move past those and uh, ignore them. So you have to use your best ju judgment on what's appropriate to use and, and what isn't. One uh, clip I have here is a six minute video clip that has various special effects. Now, this clip here, um, there's a variety of effects within it. So it's a whole bunch in a row, which um, I'm gonna give you guys um, some time to watch this. So, um, so I'll, I'll put that uh, video on for you to watch and then we'll come back to this, this page here. <laughs>
uh, back to our YouTube video here. Once we've got the clip that we want to use, then we're going to highlight the link up top here by um, triple clicking on it. We're going to copy it by going uh, either right click and hit copy or go up to edit, hit copy, or on your keyboard, if you press Command C, then that will copy it as well. Once you have the link copied, you can open either a new window or a new tab, doesn't matter. And then you're gonna go to keepvid.com. Okay, that's keepvid.com. Hopefully it loads. There it goes, okay. So now, once we're on keepvid, you're gonna paste the link in the address bar up here you can use right click and paste or you can press command V on your keyboard. Once you've got that, then you can hit the download button. And you're gonna get some information here. The one that we want is this top one here, the maximum quality. And uh, you can go ahead and click on that. If you're in Google Chrome, it should download here uh, at the bottom. If you're in Safari, it might go up top here. If you're having trouble with the downloading, you can also try right clicking and go save link as. That's another option um, if clicking on it doesn't work, okay? So I've got it downloaded. It is now in my downloads folder. So I'm gonna minimize this, open up my downloads folder by clicking on the finder at the bottom here and going to downloads. There it is right at the top, okay? I have my iMovie opened here, so now I'm going to import into iMovie. So up here in my media center, uh, I'm going to drag and drop my clip in. Don't put it down here, not right now, we'll do that later. For now, you're gonna put it in the top up here. Okay, so there's my six minute clip. Next step is going to be to put your clip um, onto um, onto the into your uh, iMovie. So my clip, I took it with the iPad and I airdropped it over. So once you airdrop, it goes into your downloads folder. So I'm gonna drag that in. There's my clip that I took of the classroom. Okay, now we're gonna put it together. So I got my two clips. The first clip you put in your timeline is the clip that you filmed, so your background clip. And then you're going to put on top of it your special effect. So in this case, I'm gonna put my six minute clip here. I obviously don't want all of it, so I need to trim it down. So it's gonna take a little bit of work. You can use your zoom here to to zoom out, but I'm gonna cut this down and I'm gonna trim it on both ends until I find um, what I want. So for this example, I'm not really gonna be that picky um, onto what I choose to use. So we'll just find one. And we can do the Raptors one. Uh, we'll go a little bit further here. Like I said, it doesn't really matter which one I pick for the example. So you're just gonna keep adjusting it uh, until you've cropped as much as you need. Oops, go a little bit more. Yeah, trim that back a bit. Okay, so I got that. Um, I'm gonna need to trim a little bit more. Because if you notice, my clip is fairly short, so you want it to actually fit on top. Okay, so you notice when I scroll through, it it's still green screen. So we need to change it to, um, change the green screen effect so that it um, combines. So I'm gonna click on, I'm actually gonna double click on my special effect. When I double click, this menu up here will come up. Right now it's on cutaway. We're gonna change it to green blue screen. And once we do that, you'll notice the green screen goes away and you can see my background. So if I go and play through this, Yeah, that turned out pretty good. Some of you will have some sound effects on, um, like if you have background sound on your clip, uh, you can remove your sound by right clicking, detach the audio, click on the audio and hit delete. Um, so then you don't have your ba background audio from your video. And then now you have, you have, your, um, you have your special effects um, on here. And that's pretty much it. Other um, special effects that are kind of cool that I just want to show you here. So I'm going to delete this one off. <coughs> Excuse me. So here I've got a cool little fog effect. Double click, change it to green screen, blue screen. And then you can see I've now made it this kind of foggy smoke effect in the classroom, which is kind of cool. Uh, let's show another one here. 
make it snow. Double click, change it over. And now it's snowing in the classroom. Ooh, that one even has some music, kind of cool. So that one's kind of neat. Okay, now I also have some special effects that I have downloaded on my computer um, that you're welcome to have. I can airdrop them over to you. I'll just give you an idea of what I have in case you want one. Okay, so here I'll make this bigger so you guys can see it. So I've got like one of these old school clock countdowns, um, a crack, floating particles, some explosions, glitches, dust puff, old film look, another glitch. I got this cool ghost effect, vortex. Uh, there's the fog I already showed you, Star Trek transport, hurricane, tornado, smoke effects, electricity, uh, explosion. I have some rain. That one's really cool. So you can make it rain. Lens flare, magical particles, some more smoke, uh, some more rain, some big heavy raindrops with puddles underneath, and snow I already showed you, uh, explosion, and particles. Okay, so I have those on my computer. Just let me know if you want any of them and I'll airdrop them over to you. Um, next, I just want to show you a couple of videos that were done by previous students that were very well done. Um, and these were just their practice ones. So here's one. This one obviously was filmed in the stairwell. And they just put the cool little skeleton on a unicycle on it. So it looks really neat. So you have to plan your video a little bit so that you've got the right angles so it kind of makes sense because you can't move your special effect around like I can't move that skeleton around um, so you have to plan your video accordingly this one I thought was really cool we got Batman dancing on the tarmac that was pretty cool so pretty simple to do um, yeah so uh, your teacher will explain to you what your assignment is for uh, this special effects lesson.